does, it, does the FBI have confidential human sources? Uh, did the FBI have confidential human sources embedded within the January 6th protesters on January 6th of 2021? Tomorrow, we need to go into the Capitol. Into the Capitol. What? No! This! 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 Well, Congressman, as I'm sure you can appreciate, I have to be very careful about what I can say about when. Even we are, now, because that's what you I, told us two years finish? ago. May I finish? Uh, about when we do and do not, and where we have and have not used confidential human sources. Uh, but to the extent that there's a suggestion, for example, that the FBI's confidential human sources or FBI employees in some way instigated or orchestrated January 6th, that's categorically false. <laughs> Did you have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters inside the Capitol on January the 6th prior to the doors being open? Again, I had to be very careful. It should be a no. Say. Can you not tell the American people? No, we did not have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters positioned inside the Capitol. Gentlemen, this time the has it. Sitting up on Summit and one marked state trooper vehicle, two black SUVs, there's three state vehicles, state trooper vehicles, escorted four Antifa shuttle buses right here, front and center. There was actually five vehicles total. There was three up front, two in the back. They escorted right here, waited for them to get off their buses, and they had the state troopers unloaded and took their positions. Watch. There's the, that guy. He had his lights on. They were coming. And then there's the ones up front too. They escort it, and each one of those buses are labeled. They're all paid charter buses. Look at that, bro. You should not read anything into my decision uh, not to share information. Director Ray, gentlemen's time has expired.